Hello and welcome to the world of Odium. This is episode 18 and today we're going to start doing some work here on uh, the Sweat Lodge. Uh, we are still uh, right by the um, the hot springs area. So there's the hot springs we did in the last time. There's our color pool, our, our geyser. Um, so I kind of got this area here I think that we're going to use. I might have to knock down some of these trees and stuff in here uh, to give us a little more room. Unfortunately, I kind of have to make this a little bit big to make it work right. So let me start by laying down my crafting table here. I've got a couple of shulker boxes of stuff we're going to need as well. And one more. And let me go ahead and put that bed down too. Put that over here. Oh, let's see. Put it there. All right. And I'm going to apologize up front if you hear a lot of noise in the background. One of my cats has decided that he's incredibly needy today. And um, he's just been very, very whiny. Um, so if you might hear a bit of that in the background, so I apologize for that. Anyways, let's, um, kind of count out the area here. Now this is going to be a circle and it's going to be, uh, have a diameter of 15. Uh, so let me go ahead and let me go ahead and grab some, uh, cobblestone real quick and we'll just use that to mark this out real quick. So I kind of want to do this. So let me come from this tree here. I'm going to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So yeah, we're going to have to knock out this tree. Let me see how far over in this direction we can go. Let me find the center of this approximately. I might have to knock down this tree too. Uh, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That would be the center. So we got two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Give us a circle. So we'd have to come back this way. So one, two, three. That's eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, so that tree's got to come down too. Okay, let me go ahead and knock out these trees that are within our area here, that, and I'll be right back with you. Okay, so I've knocked down a couple of the trees in this area, and I'm going to start marking this out. Um, what we're going to do is I've got a design that I pulled up on uh, Plots Modeler. Um, and we're going to be building this out of course dirt, and it's going to be a dome. So I'm just using um, a sphere on here and just using the top half of it to make to make a dome. So um, I've decided to make it 15 wide. Um, anything smaller and the circles kind of look funny. This one isn't the greatest looking circle this way, but uh, it's not bad either. So let me go ahead and I'm going to start this. I want to do this out of um, dirt. And the reason being is because these sweat lodges are usually, at least the photos that I've seen of them, um, they're kind of a, they're a dome structure and they're, they're dirt on the outside. Um, so this is, so I'm going to just build it completely out of dirt and then we can uh, come back and we can touch it up afterwards. I'm just going to use coarse dirt so we don't get grass growing on it. So we got five, two, one, two, and then five. Three, four, five. Two, one, 
to the next direction, and then five. direction and then five. five two one two one. Two and then five. Okay, so there is the outline of our circle. Uh, let me go ahead and I'm going to put some torches down because as this um, domes up, it's going to become very dark on the inside of this, which is definitely not what we want. We don't want to make a mob spawner here. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to build up this dome and we're going to do a time lapse of me doing this. So let, let's get started with that.
Okay, so we finished nice. the dome. Let's uh, jump down here to the bottom. All right, let's take a look at this here. I had to put that there so I could climb on top. But let's take a quick look. All right, it doesn't look too bad. Now I'm going to put a door right here. So let's go ahead and knock this in. And let me go ahead and dig up all this cobblestone that's in here now. Like that. All right, so there's the interior. We've got to clean it up a little bit, get rid of some of all this um, excess dirt that I had to place down in order to get uh, certain layers of the ceiling in, intact. Um, and then we're going to um, do some design work in here to um, maybe we'll just make it look a little more symmetrical in here. Like that, like that. Let me see. There. I know they could come down, but I like the way it looks. All right. So there's the inside, and what I do want to I do want to kind of dig out the center because in the very center of this, let me just come back in. So I've got. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It should be right in this area here. Should be the exact center of this. It's going to be the fire pit. Um, and we'll, let me just go ahead and throw a log or something in there to signify that. And again, it's not going to matter um, what we put in there. I'm going to light it on fire. Um, and it won't burn because of, of the rule that we have on the the fire spread is turned off on this particular server so let me go ahead and clean up the inside here now and let's work on the floor but before we do that i want to put up a flap on the door here. Now I'm traditionally um, these would be like covered with uh, covered with a, with like a, a tarp of some sort um, um, made from animal skin, uh, a hide of some sort. Um, but we don't have that. We do have leather, but you're not going to hang a piece of leather in front of the door here. So what I kind of figured out I could do is I can put this here and then we're going to take let me dig out a little bit of an area here like this we're going to have to dig up our floor anyways and I'm going to okay sorry just trying and we're going to hang a banner there and this is going to be our tarp and then I'm going to take the outside of this Hang on a second. Say hi to Kai. Instead of being rude. Oh, and this overpowered shovel. <laughs> and let's uh, put some dirt back in here. There we go. And now we can kind of put some half slabs in here. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to dig out the floor in here. And then we're going to completely half slab the floor, which will 
make it spawn proof for one thing, but we'll, we'll still put our, well, we won't be able to. <laughs> Let's say we're gonna put our torches back on, but you can't put torches on half slab. So let me dig this up real quick and I'll be right back with you. Okay, so I've dug down uh, one more layer here. Um, and I want to get some oak slabs. So let me come over here and I'm pretty sure I grabbed some oak. Uh, is it in this one? Yes. Okay, so let's grab a bunch of oak slabs. Put that aside for the moment. And we're going to go ahead and slab the entire floor in here. Um, now I went ahead along the edges too and I dug out the dirt that was there um, because there was pods all showing through and, and we didn't want that. So I just kind of replaced that with some coarse dirt. So let's just kind of come through here real quick and about this for a moment uh, like that and then here, I need some pods all. Got some in this gray chest. That one. This one. All right, you grab. I don't need a lot. That might be enough. All right. Fix this here before it drives me crazy. There we go. All right. Mm, should I do the entire floor? Probably. Let's let me go ahead and finish that up real quick. Okay, so I got that, and I want to put like stone around this. And I'm gonna get some more slabs while I'm at it. So I've got stone in here. Get some cobblestone. I had some in my inventory already. I can grab that other stack of slabs there. Go ahead and grab these fences too, and I'll show you what I'm doing with those. Alright, so let me go ahead and I'm going to kind of extend the entrance like this a bit, just so we can walk in and out of here fairly nicely. Okay, and then the stone. Come on, desert rat. No, 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 no. We'll use the whole. I was going to make sla uh, cobblestone slabs, but I think it'd look better if we just did it like this with whole cobblestone blocks because we. Since our floor is already half below this, I think we're good. Now, let me go ahead and let's, uh, got a flint and steel here, so we can light that. There we go. 
There's the basics of our sweat lodge. Now the next thing I want to do is I'm going to take these and let's see how this works. Now if you've ever if you've ever seen pictures of these sweat lodges, they're they're kind of built like a domed uh, camping tent. They have uh, a series of bars that go around it like this and like this um, that, that are used to support the exterior of it and then it's covered with um, the, the dirt on the outside of it. So what I want to try to do is I want to see if I can, yeah that's okay. My might be a little weird here. Uh, let me go ahead and put that away, swap back those. Um, okay, let's put that down. And let's see if we can kind of build up like this. Kind of make it look like it's, I uh, don't want that. Here. We'll do something like that. Hmm. All right, now I don't like that. Take this back out real quick. back. Alright, so how are we going to do this? So that's going to drive me crazy if I don't fix it. Alright, um... something a little different we can do put that there up here here around like this slab there and make it look like these are arches that are holding it up. Let me go around this. Yeah, I kind of like that. I know they're, well, we can connect them up too. Here like this. Yeah, I like that. Let me go ahead and uh, do the rest of this and I'll be right back with you. Okay, so I, went ahead and I, I put fencing all the way around this thing here to kind of make it look like there uh, are the supports on the inside that are actually holding the dirt back and I think that looks pretty good. I think the next thing we need to do is kind of put in some benches in here um, that the people would sit on um, that are in here performing whatever ritual it is that they're doing. So. Let me go ahead and let's see if we can do this real quick. We're going to put a couple of just Put some more half slabs down like this around here Like that Okay, maybe we'll put one in each corner as well like that go. Um, I don't know if I like these here. Let me go ahead and pop them out real quick. 
put the that back in to take a look real quick yeah I think it looks a little better without that so let me go ahead and fix those there 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 and there okay so I think that's it we have our sweat lodge all completed um, I think we could probably do some stuff on the outside here to make this look a little better of course if you have any suggestions please let me know I'm more than happy to um, look at your ideas and maybe even incorporate them in here uh, so if any of the Odium members are watching this and you have some ideas of what might make this look a little less like a, a giant uh, pile of dirt uh, please let me know and and uh, and we'll take a look at what we can do there so until next time this is desert rat have a good one goodbye <laughs>